In 2021, we added security events to the audit page, but now in 21.5, you can set a notification with triggers. Security triggers give you the ability to send an email or web request alert when a security event is attempted. On the triggers page, there are five pre-configured security triggers. If enabled and the security event is attempted, a notification will be sent. For example, for the first trigger, when a user has too many incorrect password attempts and their account locks, a notification email is sent. This is the only security trigger enabled by default. To enable or disable a trigger, click the toggle. You can also create your own security trigger. To create a trigger, click Create Security Trigger to open a dialog. I will create an email alert when a user gets prompted for a one-time password. First, name the trigger. Next, define an event filter. If you need help, you can click the plus button to choose a popular expression or click the show reference link. Finally, choose an action, either email or web request. I'll choose email. In the email dialog, leave the from and to fields blank to use the default address. Next, on the subject line, I'll use a variable to define the event. Last, select true for the HTML body. In the body box, I'll use variables for key event details. See the reference for more details. Click Save. Your new trigger should be enabled. Now, when a user is prompted for a one-time password, you'll get an email notification. That's it for security triggers. To learn more, be sure to visit our documentation at connectwise.com slash control docs. Thanks.